In this video, we will solve a problem on consumer surplus. The question is, if the demand for consumer is given by the function P is equal to 27 minus 3x minus x square, x denotes the quantity demanded and P is the price. The consumer surplus when x is equal to 3 is, the options are 50.5, 49.5, 31.5 or 32.5, okay? So, what we are being given basically, we are being given the demand function. So, our demand function is P is equal to 27 minus 3x minus x square. And we are being told to find the consumer surplus when x is equal to 3, okay? The formula for consumer surplus is simply uh, consumer surplus is equal to the definite integral from 0 to equilibrium quantity which is x okay and taking the derivative of demand function with respect to x okay minus the total expenditure and total expenditure is simply price into quantity okay so quantity is being given us as three units or let me write it again it so we have zero to definite integral the derivative of demand function which is 27 minus 3x minus x square okay we take this you know integral with respect to x and from this we subtract to the total expenditure total expenditure is simply price into output okay so first we need to find out the value of p to find the value of p uh, let me use the color here so p will be equal to just plug first the value of uh, you know output uh, into the inverse demand function so we have 27 minus 3 the value of x is 3 here so let me write it here 3 minus x square is 3 square okay so this will uh, come out to be 9 okay you can check it then our total expenditure total expenditure will be equal to price into quantity price is 9 quantity is 3 okay which comes out to be 27 therefore our consumer surplus will be equal to the definite integral from 0 to equilibrium quantity which is 3 okay and taking the definite integral of this very uh, function so we have uh, 27 minus 3x minus x square uh, dx and from this we subtract to the total expenditure okay what is our total expenditure which is uh, p uh, into x okay sorry i have written it again here so the integral of 27 will be equal to 27x by the rule of integration minus derivative of x sorry uh, integral of x uh, in this 3x will be x square upon 2 and the integral of x square is x cube upon 3 simple thing if we have x to the power n its integral is being given us as uh, x to the power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 okay simple thing what we do we add exponent with 1 and subtract with the sorry and divide with the resulting uh, exponent that means if we have x to the power 5 it is an uh, integral will be x to the power 5 plus 1 is 6 and we divide it by 6 here okay and we have to take evaluate it from lower limit is 0 upper limit is 3 minus total expenditure is price into output which is 9 into 3 9 into 3 okay let's give the variables their value so first we evaluate it upper at upper limit so uh, everywhere where we have the x we substitute it with 3 so we have 27 into 3 minus 3 into x square is 3 square upon 2 minus 3 cube upon 3 and then we subtract and evaluate it at the lower limit since lower limit is 0 every term will become 0 so we will not write the lower limit here minus we subtract the total expenditure which is 9 into 3 which is 27 when you solve it 27 into 3 is 81 minus 3 3 is 
27 upon 2 will come out to be uh, it will come out to be 13.5 13.5 so here we have if i uh, you know cancel one three i i am left with three square which is nine minus 27 solve this you will get the value is 31.5 this will be our consumer surplus okay